Sydney Olympic have had trouble scoring goals this season. They had the same problems in the early stages in the match against Sunshine George Cross at the St George Stadium. The first chance falling to Robert Ironside, he skies it well over the bar. New Zealand international there should have done a lot better. And just moments later, it was the other New Zealand international, Clint Gosling, into action, pushing this one round the post. Sunshine coach Ernie Merrick has built up a young, exciting side. He must have been happy with the form of his young goalkeeper, Frank Talia. They're denying Sydney Olympic at point blank range. Into the second half now, Sydney Olympic need an ounce of luck to break the deadlock. They got that luck five minutes in. A free kick taken by Hooker. A square ball to David Barrett who hits a screamer from 25 yards. It takes a deflection, but they all count for Sydney Olympic. That's in the back of the net. The home side have taken the lead. It was just the boost their confidence needed. Six minutes later, they increased that lead. The long corner is knocked back in by the 18-year-old Cadoza, met there by Plataniotis. In for the injured Burnell, he plants it in the back of the net. Sydney Olympic now 2-0 ahead. And they went very close to increasing that lead, only to be denied by the offside flag. By now they were playing with confidence. This was a good build-up. That was the offside move, but it's cut back. Expertly finished there by Bennett. The flag was already up, the goal doesn't stand. Just one anxious moment though for Sydney Olympic. It came from Gary Phillips, a back pass that really tested Clint Goslin. The keeper was equal to it. Two valuable points for Sydney Olympic. Sydney Olympic 2, Sunshine 0.